did the old prophets actually meet angels on top of mountains? Or were they highly intelligent beings from a galaxy far, far away? Welcome to UFOlogy, where we explore the truth about alien life. Because let's face it, we're not alone, and the evidence is everywhere. In the previous video, we dived into the mysteries of the Giza pyramids. Today, let's take a look at the Teotihuacan building complex instead. The Teotihuacan pyramids are awe-inspiring and mysterious too, albeit lesser known. Want to know more? Stick around. What is Teotihuacan? Teotihuacan means place where men become gods in the Nahuatl language. It's a sprawling, intricate ancient city in Mexico, best known for its pyramid temples. Archaeologists estimate it was built more than 2,000 years ago. There are three pyramid temples that form the city's core, in increasing order of size. The Temple of the Plumbed Serpent, the Temple of the Moon, and the Temple of the Sun. And yet, for all its wonders, little is known of Teotihuacan's original builders. The city's age, size, and complexity can make it seem otherworldly, which has led to various conspiracy theories about its true origins. The Mysteries of the Pyramids Teotihuacan was found and occupied by the Aztecs until the Europeans first arrived in Mexico. But researchers believe the city predates even their civilization. The first Aztec settlers of the city would have been explorers seeking new habitable land. In their quest, they stumbled upon Teotihuacan's deserted ruins somewhere in the 1300s. By then, the sprawling complex had been abandoned for centuries. Amazed, the Aztecs concluded that a powerful empire, possibly their ancestors, must have once resided in its vast buildings. But what empire could have been powerful enough to build such a complex with the tools of their day? Some claim the city was not built by human hands. They say aliens descended to create this hidden city in the jungle as their base to interact with humans. Others think humans did build the city with help from extraterrestrial visitors. Archaeologists have carried out numerous painstaking excavations there for centuries. They see it as the crowning achievement of a little-known but entirely earthbound civilization. It's suspected that over the centuries, a mix of cultures, including Maya, Zapotec, and Mixtec, built this city that could house more than 100,000 people. Strange Tunnels and Discoveries At the center of this mystery is an excavated tunnel beneath the city, which has taken years to dig out. The tunnel leads to chambers full of strange artifacts, including stores of liquid mercury, strange golden orbs, and sheets made of mica. The purpose of these unusual finds is hotly debated. Some experts say the original occupants preserved these artifacts to represent the underworld. This claim, however, has no solid evidence and conspiracy theorists beg to differ. They believe the city complex could have been a spaceport. Why? Well, the argument is that mica sheets and liquid mercury were impossible to process with the technology of the time. These could only have been made with the help of aliens, or so the theorists say. What were the artifacts for? The unknown purpose of these artifacts may also lend credence to the spaceport theory. Theorists suggest the sheets may have been used as heat shields, possibly to protect those handling the mercury and golden orbs. In fact, archaeologists have discovered that Teotihuacan structures show large amounts of fire damage, mostly centralized around a specific location. Maybe there was a large explosion, resulting from mishandled or badly contained energy. Such a large amount of energy could have been used to power the spaceport, allowing ships to land and take off easily. Grizzly Finds Aside from artifacts, archaeologists have also discovered grislier finds beneath the pyramids, like human remains in burial sites beneath the Pyramid of the Moon. The remains may have been used in human sacrifice and other rituals, though whether to gods or aliens, we may never know. Perhaps it's better not to dig too much into the truth. Cycles and Symbolism 
Aside from interesting artifacts, another curious discovery at Teotihuacan is the alignment of the buildings. The Sun Pyramid seems to be especially significant. This massive pyramid is one of the largest constructions in the Western Hemisphere, with an alignment based on calendrical cycles. The city as a whole was also designed in a measured rectangular grid, with its pattern oriented to the movement of the Sun. It's an alignment speculated to be a recreation of the civilization's founding myth. To quote Yale archaeologist Michael Coe, the position of individual structures might represent a creation myth, humans emerging from a vast stormy sea. This was a commonly held belief of Mesoamericans at the time. In particular, the Temple of the Plumed Serpent has many painted marine motifs depicting shells and waves. Is it possible that this unknown civilization had enough astronomical and geographical knowledge to chart such a thing accurately? Perhaps, though it seems unlikely. Maybe they had the help of superior beings. Perhaps the murals even depict mankind's emergence from the depths of space, assisted by aliens. After all, space is a dark, formless sea of sorts, too. Deformed Skulls In 2012, a strange discovery was made in Onivas, Mexico, which may shed further light on Teotihuacan's mystery. 25 human skulls were unearthed in a thousand-year-old Mexican cemetery. And these weren't just ordinary human skulls. They were warped into strange, alien-like shapes. The thing is, deformed skeletons aren't an uncommon find in South and Central America. Still, these 25 human skulls are unique. Prior to this discovery, none had been found with similar deformities this far north. These deformed skulls may indicate the widespread presence of human-alien hybrids, or even their alien masters across the region. Of course, historians dispute it. They claim that deforming the skulls of children as they grew was a common practice in Mesoamerica. Even so, there's no clear consensus why various cultures engaged in such mutilation. Many speculate they were trying to imitate their alien overlords, self-harming as an act of worship. Mysterious Disappearances As mysterious as Teotihuacan's origin and purpose is, the sudden disappearance of its original inhabitants is even more so. Extensive excavation reveals that by 400 AD, Teotihuacan had become the most influential city in the region. There were neighborhoods built in concentric cycles around the center, which eventually comprised thousands of individual family dwellings. In total, these neighborhoods may have housed up to 200,000 people. A bit like modern-day apartments in that sense. But then, by 750 AD, the city had been completely abandoned until the Aztecs discovered it almost 600 years later. Not a trace of the past inhabitants could be found. It's commonly thought that the city had begun to decline in the 6th century. Signs of internal unrest suggest a rebellion. Mid-550 AD also brought with it droughts and climate change, which could have hastened the decline. But what could have caused the abandonment of such a large city so suddenly? Was there really a war, or did they ascend to the stars? With its murals, tools, transportation system, and evidence of advanced agricultural practices, Teotihuacan is often considered much more technologically developed than should have been possible in pre-Aztec Mexico. And yet, little is known of its origins and the people who built it. Archaeological excavations are still ongoing, so we may find more evidence soon. But for now, the question remains unanswered. Were they built solely by human hands, or did their founders receive extraterrestrial help? Thanks for watching that video. Make sure to like and comment below if you believe any of the theories that aliens built or helped to build Teotihuacan.